In this video, I'm going to look at or try to explain just basic detail in the stamping in Buddha's Warrior Pounds Mortar. So quite commonly, everyone sort of wants to stamp really hard and they put all the weight into the leg that you stamp. So over time, especially on a hard floor, outside concrete, even a dirt floor, you're going to start to hurt your ankle, your knee, your hip, and, the, and also even your, your back as well. And so obviously you don't want to do that or hurt yourself because then you can't practice Tai Chi. And you know, we all love Tai Chi and we want to practice Tai Chi. So here, so when we stamp, stamp there's a little trick or a, the technique of stamping. So first, especially when you're learning, always stamp, if you're going to stamp, just place your foot down soft. Don't even try to stamp. So just place your foot down softly. Yeah, so that's, I recommend that for everyone, even most of the time when I practice, I generally just put my foot down softly. I'd hardly ever stamp, only in demonstrations or when I want to practice a lot harder or, or if I'm on grass as well. So also, the, the mechanics of the stamp, so as, you, as I lift, I'm going to sink a little bit into my hip here and here. Then as I put my foot down, so remember it's the hole of your foot, that spreads, so not just your heel or your toe, you're going to spread the hole so the, so the force spreads along the surface. And then here also I'm going to sink a little bit as I put my leg down. So as I start to put my foot down, I'm going to sink and put my foot down and that also disperses some of the force when you stamp a little bit harder. So even when you practice softly, it's good practice to sink as you put your leg down. So from here, up, so up. So look down and put my foot down and my weight is also still on my left leg and then I'm going to, once my hand and foot are down together and my foot's down, then I'm going to shift 50-50. So make sure you, you don't overshift. So if you have a look, so up, so down and then you can shift. So even now you can start to stamp and I'm not stamping really hard either. So at first just relax. So it just makes sure it makes me closer to the floor so there's less force going into it, yeah? So up, down. So also if I coordinate with my fist, look up, down, and then you can shift. So from here, up, down, and look, can you see your weight is still on your left leg? And you can stamp, and I'm not gonna hurt myself because my weight is still here. That actually feels quite nice and relaxing. I can feel the vibrations go up my leg, but my other leg is starting to ache because my weight is still here. So that's just some basic mechanics for the stamp in Buddha's Warrior Pounds Mortar. So I hope that was helpful. If you liked it, remember to subscribe and you can come learn more about Tai Chi with me at taichi.school.